this? This is Chase. Hi, Chase. Come here, bub. I know, it's a lot. <laughs> um, I'm Mariah. Nice to meet you. I'm Hi, Georgia. Guys. Thanks for nice making the trip. Nice to meet you trip. as well. I'm Chad. I'm Georgia. I'm from a suburb of Atlanta. I'm here with my husband, Chad, and our dog, Chase. So we're going to go to the park that way okay. because you guys have your dog. It's so stressful over here with dogs that aren't used to a million dogs barking. Perfect. Sounds like a plan. I'm here to hopefully find a sibling for my four-year-old dog. He's a American Staffordshire Terrier Sharpay mix that we love, and we think he needs a playmate. All right, come on. Let's go. Well, what are you guys looking for? What's he looking for? <laughs> he's a very play-driven dog. Okay. So um, he's well socialized. He meets dogs well. We want someone that has a little bit of a personality. Him. Yeah. <laughs> Playful enough to keep up with them, but also has a personality of their own. Yeah. That isn't going to be overshadowed by Chase. Of course. Right. But he needs a girl, and he needs someone a little younger. Next up is Polo. She actually lives with me. She's one of my fosters. She got found running in a market right near my house, and they called NOPD to get her, and my friend was actually outside and was like, nope, give me that, and walked her to my house. She's only around like a year old. She's really, really sweet. She really likes affection. She loves, loves, loves other dogs. You're OK. Woo. <laughs> you want to say hello? Yeah. Come on. Let's go. Come on, guys. Come on. Let's walk. Let's go that walk. way. You really don't care about anything. <laughs> yep, come on. Y'all just want to play. <laughs> the interaction between them right from the start was very positive, so that made me think very positively of her. You and your sniff? Hi. Don't be annoying, good girl. Good. Since the initial meeting on leash with Chase and Polo went really well. All right, guys, are we going to be good? The next thing we normally do is to take them off leash and see if that happiness still continues. <laughs> Polo, you're so annoying. Come on, guys! Polo definitely met the challenge when it came to, you know, being what Chase needed. I think she surpassed it as well, <laughs> more than I expected to even see in such a short period of time. How do you think he was with her? What are you thinking so far? That initial meeting was 100% positive. After today, after everything we've seen, I I'm totally ready to adopt Polo and have her come to the house. We just can't wait to have her there. Good girl. You are a wiggly thing. Woo! Chad and Georgia were realistic from the very first second that it was going to be Chase's decision. Polo and Chase, like, that was a match made in heaven. All right, buddy, you ready, handsome? We're good. Now that Chase has picked his future roommate, we're going to go get Polo ready for her road trip to Georgia. Thank so, you. I'll see you guys soon. Thank you so much. Are you ready, Polo, for your new life? I'm outside of Atlanta bringing our foster dog, Polo, to her new home. All right, Polo, we're here. I remember when Mariah came home after the meet and greet, she was like, I think it's Polo. And I was like, what? <laughs> Seriously? <laughs> Mariah and I have been fostering her for a few months now. She's very, like, well-behaved in the house, for the most part. She, she's a little crazy sometimes. She's a one-year-old. Yeah, she's <laughs> still a puppy. Hi, bud. Are you giving me five? Thanks. <laughs> to get ready, we got uh, two new crates and two new beds for her. We were able to reorganize some of the furniture to make sure that she had plenty of room and to make sure that she had felt comfortable in our home. I'm gonna grab her real quick. I am very excited for the kids to meet her. I've told them what I've known about her and you know, a little bit about her personality. Are you ready? Oh my goodness, everything's so new for you, huh? It's like moving on up in the world, huh? She's so little. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Oh, oh my goodness, God. so excited. So excited. Oh, oh. oh I sleep my hand. It's so oh. pretty. Oh, look at that. Say hi. All about the tummy rounds. Well, oh, here, since oh. she's on the ground already, I'll just like, clip her for you. Oh, oh. you sweet, mm -hmm. Polo. You're so little. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> she's like, I got to kiss everybody. When she walked through the gate, I was really thinking, wow, this is the dog that we're going to get to keep and care for. This is your new home, Polo. You like it? It's so crazy. 
<gasps> She's even more beautiful than I remember. <laughs> she is the sweetest dog I've ever met. She live up to what your parents told you? Definitely. More than not. It was cool to see how excited they were about Polo and how excited Polo was about them. There's nothing left to do but reunite Chase and Polo. Come here, Polo. Come here, we'll put you on the lead real quick. Hi. We're gonna go on a walk. Rather than doing it in Chase's yard, we decided to do it in a neutral space. So Chase didn't have the opportunity to get territorial. Come on, Pepper. Hey. Mariah had told me that Chase had growled at the other dogs and was not really into the other dogs at the meet and greet, so hopefully Chase is into Polo and it goes smoothly. Easy. Hey, Shh. sit. Hey. Chase was, was pretty intent on meeting her, and he gets very vocal and whiny. All right. Come here. Look, say hi. Good. <laughs> there it is. Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> I think at first sniff, they knew exactly who each other was. Come on. Good. <laughs> they want to play. Yeah, they do. <laughs> Once we started walking together, it seemed like they were doing perfectly fine. Oh my goodness, here we go. Oh my goodness. It's all good. Here we go. Then bringing them back to the backyard, seeing them walk together and, and not be at each other, that told me that they could coexist, that they could, they could make it as far as partners without having to play all the time. All right, here okay. we go. You guys want to run around go. and play? Go! Go play. <laughs> they have really similar play styles, too. It seemed like Chase needed something that we couldn't give him, and I think Polo's going to be able to give him what he's been looking for. The addition of Polo definitely makes our family feel complete. I have a pit oh, bull, but she has the skin of a sharp egg. Oh, my goodness. Look at you two. Oh, look at them. Look at that. They're just going to be cuddle bugs. Look at this. What are you doing? Aww. I think that life is going to play out great for both of them. We gave Chase a loving home four years ago. We're doing the same for Polo now, and both of them will be spoiled rotten. <laughs> <laughs> All right. This is for y'all. Thank you. All right, Polo. Get out of here before I start getting all emotional. Bye, y'all. It's relieving to know that this dog that we took in and took care of is going into a wonderful home with a loving family and another dog to play with. 